So if you don't know, the work T7Rs are originally off the 240 and that car is not gonna be done for a while. So I decided instead of them just sitting on the car doing nothing, I'd throw them on here for the time being, but I picked up a new set of wheels. So we're gonna get those mounted on the Z, get these back on the 240 so I can roll that out and do things to it in the driveway. And um, so here are the new wheels for the Z. So just a quick rundown of everything. We have the Kanzai Tandems and Hyper Silver. The specs on these are 18 by 10 and a half and 18 by nine. And then they're gonna be held on with some racing TNR1 lug nuts. This is our titanium line of lug nuts. Um, everything about these is unique to us. We have our own special key made and the key feature on the lug nut is forged with a nice little cap in there with the racing logo. So. These are available in Spitfire, which is like your burnt titanium look, beaded or brushed black, which I have here. And I was lucky enough to get these off the clearance section of the website. We have a bunch of shift knobs and we have some lug nut sets on there. So be sure to check it out at racing.com. And then we got a 225.40 in the front and a 245.40 in the rear. So I'm gonna go ahead, grab the jack and we can get started. So one cool feature that we came up with was this cover here for your lug nut tool. So this just snaps on like that. And then when you put your lug nut on, it covers the side of your lug nuts. And then depending on your wheel style, when you go to install or take off your lug nuts, this will protect the uh, finish of your wheels. assumption that when I put the cans eye wheels on I'm probably gonna have to run a front spacer because these are um, nine and a half plus 12 and the new wheels are nine plus 12 so got about a half inch difference there on the width so I'm gonna probably have to run a little bit of a spacer we'll have to see so these are the front calipers that I'm gonna paint um, I'm gonna paint them black and then I'm gonna put on some new fluorescent yellow Brembo decals on there. So I'm gonna go ahead and probably unbolt these and uh, sand them up and then get them painted. So I just threw a coat of black paint on these. They are nowhere near perfect, but I'm gonna let these dry and then throw the Brembo decals on and then put a coat of clear on top of that.
So I got both front calipers back on. So I'm gonna go ahead and bleed these really quick and then we can get the wheels mounted and the front bumper installed and that should be it. So I'm gonna go ahead and throw these spacers on right away. These are one inch spacers. We got all four wheels on, bumpers back on. Last thing I wanna do is just put some of these spoke decals on that I made, and then we'll get some final shots. So that's gonna be it for this one. My phone's pretty much dead, but the wheels look great. I actually like them on here better than the uh, work wheels. So I just need to re-bleed the front brakes because I went to go leave the driveway and couldn't stop. So I'll get that done. And uh, otherwise, car looks good. And uh, that's it. Thanks for watching. See you on the next one. Mm -hmm.